Hello! The objective of this tutorial is to review the Share Sets functionality in WISE. Share Sets are very useful as they allow you to share settings for several objects at once. Changes made to these settings are applied immediately to all objects that are subscribed to the Share Set. Currently in WISE, Share Sets can be applied to effects and to attenuations. Let's now focus our attention to the Share Sets tab in the Project Explorer. This tab displays a complete list of effect and attenuation share sets organized into work units. You can create and manage your share sets and their corresponding work units in this tab. You will also notice that there is a factory effects work unit. This contains all of the factory presets that are automatically included in each WISE project. For the purposes of this video tutorial, we will focus on effect share sets as the same mechanisms are used for managing attenuation share sets. Let's now create a new effect share set. Right click on the effects default work unit and select the new child WISE parametric EQ menu option. Name it shared EQ1. Let's now import four car sounds into WISE. Double click on one of the newly created sound objects. Moving now to the Property Editor, click on the Effect Selector and select the Shared EQ1 from the WISE Parametric EQ menu item. Now select Use Share Sets from the Effect Mode menu. Note that it is also possible to create new share sets using the Effect Selector in the Property Editor. Let's now apply the Effect Share Set to the other imported car sounds by using the Multi-Edit functionality in WISE. In the Project Explorer, select the other three car sound objects. Perform a right click and then select the Multi-Edit option. The Multi-Editor dialog now appears. From the Multi-Editor, select the Shared EQ1 option from the WISE Parametric EQ menu item. Now select Use Share Sets from the Effect Mode menu. Press OK to apply the changes and to close the Multi-Editor dialog. The effect share set has been applied to all of the other car sounds in the project. Let's now look at the power and flexibility of using effect share sets in your WISE project. Double click on one of the car sounds, then click on the effect edit button on the property editor. This will display the properties of the share set parametric EQ in the effect editor. Note that the objects subscribed to this share set are listed in the shared by list. Now play the sound, then modify the EQ's parameters. Since we have applied an effect share set to all of the car sounds, all of the objects using that share set are affected. You now notice and hear that the same EQ settings have been applied to all of the car sounds. There may be cases when you want to convert share sets into custom instances. Remember that a custom effect instance is only applied to a single object only. When you change the properties of a custom instance, only this object is affected. This change can be made by simply selecting the Define Custom option from the Effect Mode selector in the Property Editor. This concludes the Share Sets video tutorial. As mentioned earlier, share sets can currently be applied to both attenuations and effects in your WISE project.